What's up, Internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to my Let's Play of the 2K16 My Career Mode for the PS4. It is Ebenezer's Revenge! And some of you have said that, apparently, in order to challenge Seamus, I must be in the top three. Uh, so I must increase my rank one more, which means getting into a mostly pointless feud with either Dolph Ziggler, Goldust, or Luke Harper. And I, I, I was attacked by both Harper and Goldust uh, recently, so there's that. I mean, that means that Seamus just won't show up on those shows? Like, that's kind of messed up. So, in any event, Brock Lesnar on Raw, uh, on this Monday, Monday Night, Night Raw, and I mean, I could go attack Ziggler here. Uh, and I just might do that because, shit, I don't know. Gotta have a match for Fastlane, right? So, no, don't, don't, uh, I hit the wrong button again. I always do that. I hit the fucking options button. Can I just go back? Nope. I'm, I'm stuck now. I'm stuck now. Whatever. Whatever. Now, the last time that I was supposed to fight the Beast, there was an interruption. This time, thankfully, uh... Oh, there's an interruption. Um, okay. But who's he interrupting? Who's... Suplex City. Who is Seth Rollins coming to go and, and mess with? Is the question. That's what I want to know. Who is he cheering on? Who is he, who is he here for? Is he here to feud with Lesnar or what? Uh, so yes, welcome to a bright and early... Tuesday, as I sit and record this, uh, have not watched Raw as usual, because I watch Raw on Tuesday night, but certainly I'm on the internet, and therefore you can't avoid, you can't avoid hearing at least something about Raw every week, and oh, he's here to fucking fuck with me. Good job, Rollins. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Rollins. Uh, what a waste. Um, so certainly I have heard about the monumental change to this year's Royal Rumble, and I will certainly get into to, to, to... Oh, wait, now it's Mr. Lesnar? Why is he here? Whose side is he on? I, I will certainly get into a lot of what I think about that change to the Rumble on uh, my Raw reactions tomorrow. But suffice to say, it does make the landscape of what's happening uh, more interesting this year than most years. Uh, but only if they actually take it in an interesting direction, which having faith in them to do that is not always the most wise thing in the world, because they've certainly had just solid gold on their hands and fucked it up time and time again. So, here's hoping. But otherwise, you know, like, I didn't really see any other major stuff from Ross. I really don't know, uh, what else. And I'm looking forward to watching it, as always, uh, tonight over at Grimm's house and going to film uh, Perplexing Pixels, which I have not, I haven't really, it's like, it's Tuesday and I haven't decided what game yet. I think we're going to play the original Smackdown game on the PS1, I gotta find that, it's in this house somewhere. Um, so that, that is kind of the plan. Nope. Alright, now we're going to deal with Brock just staring at us. Come on, I reversed that. Come on! Oh, suplex city to the outside. Um, keep staring at me, Brock. I'm not a Jimmy John sandwich. God damn it. Reverse something, Ebenezer! Oh, that sucks. Get up, Ebenezer! He broke the count, at least, to inflict more punishment. Which is totally an appropriate thing for Brock Lesnar to do. Uh, so I was having uh, a thought this morning as I woke up. In that, if you really wanted to make the career mode awesome. If you really wanted to make this stuff, like, fun to play. Wouldn't it be cool? And I understand this is probably way too much work for them to ever do. But wouldn't it be cool if getting into feuds with guys, like, you... the the feuds were based on, you know, what the actual character would do. Now, granted, having to write new stuff and having to animate new cutscenes for each individual guy on the roster when there are, like, you know, 120 of them, or whatever, uh, is perhaps too much, right? But, 
what if you took it from past feuds? Like, what if your Kane feud ended up with you getting dragged up under the ring? And, you know, like, what if your Brock Lesnar feud had a car getting smashed up? You know, like, take it from things that already happened, uh, and that's your shortcut. And at least that would give you more variety in in this career stuff instead of having this, kind of the same stuff over and over and oh no that's a del rio armbar no get the fuck away from me mr lesnar i need to give you the eye poke of doom poke in the eye the flicky the wrist f5 to brock lesnar got my sp that's what's up seth rollins hey seth rollins future of this business. Nope, sorry Brock. The flicky de wrist. Alright, so this is actually a bit of a challenge here, or at least it has been so far. Uh, as you can tell by my fucking health bar. So whether or not I can beat Brock with the constant distractions of Rollins at ringside uh, remains to be seen. But hell. Give it a shot, you know. I I already got my bonus SP. I don't think losing to Brock is going to affect my ranking because Brock's not in the IC title. Like, if that affected my ranking, that would make no fucking sense because I'm not... He's not in the IC title ranking, I don't think. I'm pretty sure. Uh, and he's certainly not in, in the, the top three. Like, it should only affect your ranking if somebody else in the rankings uh, is there, you know? Get... Onto the thing, onto the do your flippy doos. Flippy doos! It looks so good. It looks so good. Pin him! Nope. You ain't pinning Brock on that shit. Come on now. Brock has signature, which is frightening. Thunderbolts and lightning. Uh. Alright. Picking him up. Poking him in the eye. And then kicking him in the gut. And doing one of these. Which still looks awesome. And then Seth. By God Rollins. Hey. Punch him. Punch Raw. I'm hitting the punch button you motherfucker. I'm not. I'm not. Ugh, God damn it. Why. Is the option to punch him not there. And now I got fucking Brock. Goddamn Lesnar. The Beast Incarnate. Nope. Alright, well, that sucks. Now he has Finisher. This is gonna be bad for everyone involved, because now we're gonna get F5'd. Or not. Fuck you! I hit the button, fuck you! God damn it. That's some horn swoggle horse shit right there. Why is Neville so mad at us? I don't understand that either. But hey, got my bonus SP, I guess. Certainly. Oh, here we go. No, I'm not feuding with someone who's not in my IC rankings. I'm not changing. I've gone so far to get this fucking IC title. I'm not going to stop now. Not on my level. He shouldn't even be in the ring with me. I'm gonna make quick work of him and move on to bigger and better things. That's all I gotta say about that. That's all I gotta say about that. What? Heh. <laughs> what? Fucking from where? No. Literally no. Is this turning into a rivalry for you? What the fuck are you smoking, video game? Who are we talking about here? You're interviewing me, and you're asking about that guy? Yeah, Sin you're asking about Sinkara? Out with a shoulder injury? No. I want nothing to do with him. He's boring. A B-plus player. Sinkara's like a C-plus player. Come on now. Realistically. That's right, Sinkara. Alright, back to you, Cole. Ha! As I was saying, there is certainly in real life no shame to losing to Brock Lesnar because he's goddamn Brock Lesnar. But 
In the video game, I was in that feud with him, and I've beaten him before, so that is the unfortunate interference of Seth freaking Rollins. And now we gotta fight Wade Barrett again. So, top three is Ziggler, Goldust, Harper. So, hopefully Ziggler. I mean, if we can uh, see him again on a show, that's not gonna happen. Let's see who we got here. Sting Taker, because that's going to open, uh, open up a SmackDown, sure. Dallas Swagger, Henry, Fandango, Neville. There's Sheamus. Okay, let's try that. Dean Ambrose, Randy Orton, Roman Reigns, Brock Lesnar. That, that, that's a hell of a SmackDown. But hey, hey Sheamus. You've been ducking us, Sheamus. Hey Sheamus. Now, this might get me a match at Fastlane, and it might not. But I think it is worth making the attempt at attacking Sheamus on the stage top. But first, but first, we're going to fight Barrett again, which is not even worth doing, honestly. Okay, here we go. I'm afraid I've got some bad news. And that is you are facing me again, Barrett. What are you going to do about it? He totally blocked my cross body. He totally blocked the cross body. I didn't even get a, 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 a reverse thing there, which fucking, there it is. Uh, like, I totally don't even care about fighting Barrett. Like, could not, like, had our feud. This is like the eternal problem in wrestling. Like, you had the feud or whatever, and you're still having matches. Like, who the fuck cares? Move on to somebody else. But hey, it's a video game. This is how much I give a shit about fighting Wade Barrett again. That much. Boom. Alright. Oh no. Renee Young. Why are you talking to me now? I don't give a shit. They're all jealous. They will respect me once I go back there and demolish every single one of them. The guys in the back, they're either jealous or scared. I can understand that. I mean, look at me. I am the most dominant force in the WWE today. There you have it. Back to you guys. And now it is time to go attack the Celtic Warrior, the palest man in sports entertainment today, Sheamus. Alright, here on SmackDown, Baton Rouge, Louisiana. I've been there. Long time ago, I, I've been there. Um, and waiting for his fella! Although, I do miss his old theme song, because it was a shameful thing. Lobster head. Too many limes. Too many limes. Boom. Sheamus. Nope, it got reversed. God damn it, Sheamus. He's too strong for me. Haha. -ha. Boom! Elbow drop. Mega name very sad, Michael. Ball game. Under the steel steps by God. Boom. Stomping, mud hole, walking. It dry. Poke you in the eye. And we we'll do the high cross. Yes, the high cross. Yep, yep, yep. Boom into the crowd. That's what you get, Seamus. Talk of trash. So does that mean Renee Young again? Maybe? Nope. 
But that's five five little notches there for Seamus, so... Oh, wait, never mind. There's Renee. Hey, hey, why'd you attack Seamus? Hey, hey, why? Why'd you do... I want his belt. I wanted to see who would flinch first, but it looks like he's not scared of me. Okay. And I'm not scared of him. Hey, here's a wonderful. Who's in a match? Put me in a match with him. If a match between us ever were to go down, it would be one of the best. We of already all had time. a match. You I lost. This? I know this. The WWE Universe knows this. It's the only matchup to make. That's a bold pick, Cotton. Let's see how it plays out. There's a lot of tension brewing between you two. What's going on there? Yes, the tension is he's been ducking me for weeks. You better run. Yeah, there is tension between us. <clears throat> tension that's going to end soon with me putting him through the mat. He's in my sights, and I'm not going to quit until he's done for. I know you can hear me out there. <laughs> I know you can hear me. You better not get in the ring with me, because it will be your last match. Hide your kids, hide your wife. There you have it. All right, that bye, Renee. Nice. Bye. And that should wrap it up for today. Not that I'm... Uh, completely satisfied with where we're at, but that's going to half wrap it up for today as we roll into Raw the following week in February 2017. There we go, Sheamus locked into a rivalry with Sheamus, who is the IC champion, so dear God, give us a title match at the next pay-per-view, which is fast lane at the end of... Oh, and of course we're, we're going to fight him tonight. Non-title, which, sure. Yes, there are plenty of, if I can beat him non-title, they would have to give me a, a title match, right? Right? That's how wrestling works, right? I don't know. Anyway, uh, yeah, so that will be tomorrow. Going to fight some Sheamus uh, again, and that'll be fun. But until then, and until next time, this has been my continuing squeaky-ass chair here. I'm a tax lug. This has been the Let's Play of 2K16. My career mode, Ebenezer's Revenge, the PS. Four, and I will see you next time and every day for more videos right here on the channel. And I'm out, Bella.